Turning now to a CBS News Health Watch, colorectal cancer is the second most common cause of cancer death in the U.S., and one of the best ways to screen for it is with a colonoscopy. A new study tonight is raising some questions. CBS News Chief Medical Correspondent Dr. John LaPook is a gastroenterologist who performs colonoscopy and, and joins us, and I'm so glad you're here because there are these headlines on the Internet that say colonoscopies fail to prevent colon cancer deaths. That's misleading, correct? I do think it's misleading, Nora. I mean, this was a tricky study to interpret, which is why I spoke with the study author. He happened to be in Norway uh, just a few hours ago. And uh, let's just take a look at the study. Now, it was a large European study, and over a follow-up period of about 10 years, the people who were offered colonoscopy had an 18% lower risk of getting colorectal cancer, but no difference in dying from it. And that's lower than expected. But only 42% of people offered a colonoscopy actually got it. The people who actually got a colonoscopy had a 31% lower risk of getting colorectal cancer and a 50% lower chance of dying from it. And I have to ask you, you know, as a doctor who, who does all of these colonoscopies, what are the guidelines about when you should get screened? Well, they would just drop to 45 for people at average risk uh, for the first screening, and if you're at increased risk even earlier. The bottom line is you should check with your health care provider, and colonoscopy and screening is the best thing you can do to try to prevent early death from colon cancer. Nora? Such important information. Thank you, Dr. LaPook.